Okay, I'm here with uh, Dr. Elena Remizova. Uh, Elena, this place is right in the heart of the city, the Russian consulate. How did you decide that this place should be dedicated to chess? And we can see over here, it's so beautifully made up. Uh, hello, everybody. Uh, originally, maybe you don't know, we have several uh, Russian houses through India at, uh, I guess, five. And in each Russian house, we have a chess club. Each chess club has the name of a Russian player of, or Soviet player. It was a traditionally very long, but due to COVID, uh, here in Mumbai, our chess uh, club was closed for several time, for several years. Uh, recently, uh, several months ago, we opened, reopened this Russian Chess Academy. Uh, and uh, we are very happy to have today here such a big, huge event. Uh, it's around 150 children, yes, uh, take place. I'm very happy to see all these children here. Uh, and also I would like to take a chance to announce that we decided to sign the MOU with uh, Chess Academy from St. Petersburg uh, because uh, Mumbai and St. Petersburg is the sisterhood cities and this year we celebrate 56th anniversary of the sisterhood uh, and I hope that we will take uh, another tournament in the end of May on the day of the birthday of St. Petersburg. Oh. This will be 28th of May. This would be an online event. This will be an online event between Indian players and players from Russia. Uh, it will help to improve skills, I believe, to children. Uh, and uh, anyway, this will be established of relations first online. And after, I hope uh, that uh, people from St. Petersburg will come here, children, children from Mumbai will come to St. Petersburg and play face to face. Well, well you spoke about how there are different uh, chess academies in India named after great champions of Russia. And uh, in fact, there's a Tal Academy, uh, Tal, uh, which was in Chennai. Yes. And that was instrumental in Vishwanathan Anand, uh, uh, who is now the five-time world champion, him growing up from there. There's this beautiful academy in Kolkata uh, called the Alekhine Chess Club. Yes. So, so what is the, the vision behind it? Is it to promote the chess here, uh, to find new talents in, in India? What would you say? Uh, Originally, we believe in Russia that uh, India is the motherland of chess. Of course, um, has the great opportunity to establish the cultural and sport connection in this field. And this game is very popular in Russia too. And in Soviet Union it was. So this is the one field uh, where we hope we can be connected. Uh, why names of Soviet or Russian players? It's uh, because it's a Russian house. <laughs> Maybe, but uh, unfortunately I'm not a chess player, mm -hmm. but Mr. Zuviri said that uh, we have uh, our Russian um, chess school and the way and style of playing. Uh, it's a little bit different from others and uh, I believe these places help to promote this play or this style of playing for children. Well, fantastic. I mean, this coming up in Mumbai is a great uh, boon for the players here because they get a chance to play in tournaments, they get a chance to train, improve. So big thank you to you uh, for, for making this happen. I am very happy that this happened and uh, I think that we will collaborate and further and further and to reach uh, great goals. Thank you. Brilliant. Thank you so much. <laughs>